welcome back to the Ribbit and Bigot Show. I'm Jolly, your conservative host, with my co-host, K-Log. How's it going tonight, buddy? Uh, it's going fucking awesome, Snow. How are you doing? Not too shabby. Got a full chubby. And we got the Miss Hotness herself, Tarzan, in the house. What's going on, Tara? Not too much. I'm glad to be here. Y'all are the first to see my face on camera. It's absolutely spectacular. Thank you. Hey, -o. Yeah, I'm hey, a little mesmerized. But I'm, all, I'm also you're, mesmerized yeah. by the man. You, you ain't bad, The man, too. the myth, the legend. <laughs> Mexican Iron Man. Hail! Hail! Hail, you look lovely. Hail, you look amazing. Snow, it has been far too long, my old friend. Wait, you said I look amazing, right? Wait, over here. Uh, okay, you look amazing. Oh, you're so emotionally needy. What kind of shit is this, Snow? Just simmer down over there. Simmer down. We just started. I'll, I'll get you some more cocaine on, on the way. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. So, uh, topic for tonight is 40th anniversary of Empire Strikes Back. So, uh, this is the best Star Wars movie ever, right? Absolutely. Yes. I think you're a serial killer if you say otherwise. It is a book. Like, I think you're so. a white guy from Oregon. If you say that, <laughs> probably. Yeah, that's like eighty percent chance, right? That lives by the river. Oh no! Well, that's now we're talking. Yes. You know, now we're talking ninety-nine percentile. Big time. You know, I'm from the Northwest. Just saying. Uh oh. Doesn't mean anything though. <laughs> so what's your favorite uh star wars empire strikes back uh scene uh let's start with you k-log you got a favorite scene from the movie yeah the best line in movie history when leia says i love you and han just says you know i know i know boo i got it and then he just dies at the time he thought he died i did i love it he's a mac yeah. he's definitely a frog <laughs> Yeah, solo what fuck for saying? sure. Oh, yeah. I think so. The Han Solo played by Harrison Ford, he fucks for sure. The new guy, yeah, he probably fucks. Oh, well, maybe. Oh, what about you, uh, Mexican Iron Man? When uh, Luke, without being fully prepared, decides he's going to take on Vader. Mm. Mm. Saber to saber. Yeah, that's a good scene. It is so cool because you're like, you're cheering, but you just know this just might not end the way you hope it would. Hmm. That's how you feel when you walk through the grocery store. <laughs> yeah, especially the toilet paper department. There's no toilet paper in San Francisco. <laughs> There's a little bit in southern San Jose. You got to go to the Mexican market, though. I got to bring you with me, apparently. Yeah, I'll get you in. I'll get you in. You say, mi amigo es... Build that wall. <laughs> yeah, I've been trying. Me and Mark the Infinitely Tired have been still... Everybody forgot to fund the wall, and me and Mark the Infinitely Tired have been raising money for the wall that never got built so we can finish building it. Well, that sounds like a lot of work. Like yeah. yeah. What's your favorite uh, scene, Tara? I like gore, yeah. gore and horror, so when they... Uh... When Han Solo cut open the Tauntaun and put uh, Luke in there, that was probably mm. my favorite. It smells bad on the inside, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just got a raging lightsaber. I like it. Sorry. I used to work at a restaurant, oh. and I had this guy. He bought me a uh, for a Christmas gift. He bought me a Han on Tauntaun, like, $200 gift, and I fucking lost it because I drink too much. <laughs> but I always remember that. Oh, Han no. and Tauntaun. Oh. Wow. Not just so bad. I don't have a lightsaber. It feels That's like dope. a big competition here. He's one of the force. 
Well, we already know who would win that, K-Log. Thank you. Thank you. I got a collection of lightsabers. I collect them. I got like, shit, I don't even know how many of these I got at this point. Whoa. It seems like it'd be hard to breathe <laughs> in that game. It seems like yeah. it'd be hard to breathe. Yeah. I got all kinds of lightsabers. I love them. I had a couple. My kids broke them. Oh, oh, stay out of the chat. Was got, that good? Uh, got a few Did peeps here. Uh, Sorry, Snow. Oh. I was just trying to say hi to the chat. We got a, well, a lot of people here, actually. We got Tommy and Red Gaze. Hail! Mark the Infinity Tired. Infinitely. Welcome. I love tamales. Infinitely. I love tamales. Why oh. tamale build the wall? Oh, my God. Hey, we got Terra's on in the house. Wait. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to keep up with both. Now I'm all confused. Damn. Multitasking. Yeah, good job, Snow. You can do it. Wookie Supremacy. Hail, Wookie. Hail. And Second Street Marvel in the house. I think I've seen Second Street Marvel in here somewhere, too. Yeah. Hail yeah. 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 Trinity. Hail yeah. Trinity. No, how does it feel uh, to be on camera? Are racist. Time, Tara? Huh? What? How, how does it feel to be on camera? Very weird. Very weird. I'll get used to it. Liquid courage helps. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it helps with everything, apparently. I'll drink to that. It does. I've, I've just got to be careful and behave myself a little bit. Oh, yeah. no. Yeah. Hey, wake <laughs> up, y'all. Cheers. Wait a minute. I, I, I am going to pour me one myself right now. Hold on. No, no, no. <laughs> we should, no, no, we should be part of the mask. It's a ribbon bigot show. Right. It's close by, so yeah, you know, you if, I, if I need a refill, I've got it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, all these are racist. Yeah, <laughs> what are you drinking there, Mexican Iron Man? Uh, Johnny Walker, uh, Black on the Rocks. Like a Johnny Skywalker. Yeah, Johnny, <laughs> Johnny yeah. With lots of ice here. Watch, check it out. Wow, it makes sounds in it. Stop. Uh oh, hold on. I gotta wow, that's start this. Thing. You guys are you guys are multitasking. I love it. Yeah, that's um, how you do it. Yeah. My cat is making a debut. Also, who is that? My cat is. Yeah, my dog. My dog now, is. yeah. What did you name that pussy cat? I think my dog's here. His name is Nino Grayson, the shadow. Get the fuck off yeah. the table. The shadow knows. That's a bad <laughs> pussy. He's terrible. He's giving me a hard time tonight because he knows I'm on camera. Nice. I've been known <laughs> to give the pussy a hard time. <laughs> I like that one, Snow. I like that one. We gotta we gotta sell our jokes like that. We can before Megs comes back. <laughs> oh, that's right. Yeah. That's well, right. We're, that's we're right. consent that's free. Right. Snow, yeah. Snow. I was gonna say I have to behave because Megs is not here to, to talk about consent. So right. Um, she might judge you. She might judge hey, you. She might. Hey, hey, hey Snow, is it, does it embarrass you if I tell you if I say like how I was your first fan and how I met you online? No, I love that story. You want to tell it, or can I tell it, or we both tell it? You, yeah. Oh no, you tell it. Yeah, it's a great story. All right, so check this out. So it was a time way back, way back when, and so this is kind of to both of you guys. Okay, so I'm telling it to both of you guys, but I, but I, but you know, I wrote the text to Snow, and so, I mean, I don't care they came to the, you know, fandom. Wait, 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 wait. Let me get my pants. Let me get my pants down first. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. so check. Okay, go ahead. All right, so so re although originally for Comics Gate and the Phantom Menace, I came to the internet, you know, to you know, meet a lot of people, hear a lot of stories. Eventually, the negativity got way too much, and it, it just got way too like fucking ugly. And I was getting really turned off, and I was having a, I own a business, and I was having a hard time at business, and work sucked, my relationship sucked, my you know, my, my ex and I were splitting up, just life sucked across the board. I mean, really bad. And I don't get, I'm not the kind of guy that gets down. I'm a pretty optimistic guy. 
like you know but i was just down and then you know the one place yeah. that i was having a lot of fun was youtube but it was getting really shitty and you know it's also around the same time that you know when jeremy's going cross country and then you know the thing with you and megs and you know you guys were trying to connect and and then i saw some kind of tweet you made or a comment you made or a comment you made. i think it was with the um with the author steven and you guys he was interviewing you and you seemed down and i thought yeah. i thought for a second i'm like oh shit this guy's gonna cut his channel and go off air and and oh no and well that's oh. I'm not saying that's what he said I just got that vibe for a second and I was down and 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 but the thing that had happened yeah. is just the night before you guys had had a show that I watched and it was so fucking hilarious you guys were on fire you went for two and a half hours it was so funny that I that I had to literally pull over because I laughed so hard I almost ran into another <laughs> car and the center divider on the 101 all right it was hilarious. Number two is that is that I was laughing so hard. I was laughing so hard. I said, screw this. I pulled over and I went to a Burger King. I said, I'm just gonna listen to the rest of the show. Nice. And I and I I, I got Burger. I mean, I don't really yeah. eat Burger King. I don't really eat that crap, but I did, and I sat there in the parking lot. You guys finished your show, and and I was just I said, you know what? I said, however bad life is, life cannot be that bad. I mean, you guys were cracking on everything and everybody. And I'm gonna start crying right now. You guys were cracking on everything and everybody. And I looked at my life. I'm like, my life is not so bad. It's like my life is actually pretty great if I look at it from another perspective. And then a day or two later, snow was kind of down or something, and I was like, bro. And then I wrote you this. I wrote you a DM on Twitter, right? I think, or I sent you. I don't know how I did. I wrote yeah. you. I found your email somehow, and I said, listen, bro, you don't know me. I'm a fan. You don't know me for shit. I'm not in California. I said, I don't know what's going on, but if you're down or whatever, just call me. You know, you guys really turned my life around. I mean, I'm not going to say I was suicidal because I wasn't, but I was so down in the dumps yeah. that, like, I, I like I, I went to work three days in a row, closed the door, and did nothing. I was just really down. And that night, you're, you guys are showing, you had a bunch of guests on. I have not laughed so fucking hard since, you know, I don't know, when I was, like, maybe 1983 and I heard Eddie Murphy for the first time on Raw. Like, that hard laughing. Uh, and I I, my, thank you. I usually compare ourselves to Eddie Murphy. That's a really good comparison. Well, I have not laughed that night. I laughed so, and you guys were just cuffing. Nothing scripted. Nothing like all these internet guys where all their stuff's prepackaged. You know, you guys are just rolling. Yeah. And I'm just like, God, I haven't laughed so hard since I was like a little, you know, since I was a kid watching Eddie Murphy. And I'm like, oh my God, this is the best. This is the best show. And then I and then I started, you know, and then I heard, and so I just reached out to Snow, and I didn't know how he was going to react. I think he's, I don't know if he thought I was going to be a stalker, <laughs> you know, just trying to do a reach around i mean i don't know what he thought but i mean i don't know so yeah. i'll turn it over to you at that point but i just well, sort of you, said you i'm just sort of so happy kisses. huh i was i don't know i'll just say this well, goes, I, said, I was so kisses. happy that you guys stayed online that and you kept going and what i love about the channel is that you guys are doing it your own way and you're not riding the coattails of nobody you're not ass kissing you're not making deals to like you know let everybody borrow your comedy to boost their channel so your numbers right. go up you guys are like doing it your own way and you know i've had a really tough six weeks with this uh sba shit with trump i've been working in the scenes in the in the saving small businesses and getting loans out um for people for the last six weeks wow so i haven't really been on online at all not very much but i'm but i'm back yeah. now work is done and, and i'm back all the money's out and, you know life is good so but i just want to say i'm glad you guys are still around and, and it really made a difference to me you know you don't someone would say comedy can't make a difference in life but you guys did at the time and you made me stay with youtube Shit, there would have been a Mexican Iron Man. Mexican Iron Man, the character I created came after that. Mexican, there wouldn't be a Mexican Iron Man. And I, you know, I met a lot of great friends. And, and I just thank you guys for being you because I really mean it. It's a huge honor to be on the show. And I, there's, you guys are the most unique, funniest guys show on the net that no one knows about. But it's going to get huge. I, I know it will eventually because you guys are just amazing. The talent. I just love it. And you're raw. Go ahead, Snow. I could listen to that all night. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> I could listen to that all night. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know I mean it, bro. You know. You I, know I do. Hey, I appreciate that. No oh, joke. That was great. Yeah. You're good people, my friend. Yeah. And glad, no. glad you're doing good. And uh, shit's working out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. And you, you, guys, you guys deserve a lot of respect for how you're doing it, man. No, seriously. And you know what I mean, Snow. You know, there's a lot of newer channels that popped no, up. Oh, we and, love you, Mexican Iron Man. You know. And, you yeah, know, we love you, man. Uh, I don't, you know, I don't dick i don't suck dick okay unless the one situation in which young harrison ford and princess leia want to have a menage a frog <laughs> right that's facts or bruce, uh, bruce campbell it's you know, 
<sighs> oh, by the way, I got another one. Your music, I actually, here, check this out. I knew snow before I knew snow was snow was snow. You know how? I heard that freaking what? Seattle Seahawks song in my 49er parking lot years <laughs> ago. Years ago. And then, and then I come to find out he did music. I'm in the middle. He sends me like six or seven tracks. The third track was a, the fucking Seattle track. And I'm like, no, he did it. This is not the same guy. <laughs> and, and I literally died. I literally died. I'm like, holy shit. That's funny. My five seconds of fame. Yeah. yeah. I've seen what? the snow oh, moon thanks, walk. Thanks, Mexican Iron Man. <laughs> huh? I've seen the snow moon oh. walk. So. Really? It's true. And I'm here because of wow. Kennedy. Because you guys are the reason I kept coming back to the chat. That was I found my my people. Hey, yeah. There's a lot more of us out there. They just don't know where, they just don't know where to go. Your puppets. It was completely inappropriate yeah. and uh so much fun. So that's why I'm here. Yeah. Trinity is somebody I actually hey, consider the a real Yeah. Hail the cotton connection. Hail the con connection. Yeah, real for yeah real. I love compliments. I love compliments. Yeah. Well, you guys, you guys are, you guys are dead. I mean, yeah. Yeah. You should, you should just do a monologue for the rest of the show. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> no, but do you right. remember Eddie Murphy when he I did Raw Delirious? Remember that? Yeah. Yeah. God, I never yeah. laughed so hard then, 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 then or since. Then or I just since. ordered a pair of red leather pants actually from Amazon. I'm waiting for them to get here. Yeah, you know what the funny thing is? Is like sometimes when like I'm having like uh, I need to get a lot of work done. I play some of the old shows because I got behind in December, January. Yeah. But I forgot there's so many f bombs and shit in there, and I'm at the office, right? Right. <laughs> and someone will walk in, and I'm see, I'm desensitized to it because it's me, right? And, you know, it's me. I'm you. You're me. You know, it's us. And I'm you know I'm sitting there like yeah yeah okay so I need a memo and you know they're looking at me like I'm a weirdo. I'm like what? What's the problem? Oh shit! You know. <laughs> you know? Not like you're masturbating. Uh, <laughs> well, exactly. Well, mentally, mentally, mentally. Hey, hey, Lori Roberts. Hey, masturbation. Wait. <laughs> hey, Lori. Yeah. Oh, we got all kinds of cool peeps in the chat tonight. Thanks for tuning in. Smash that this like is, button. This so, is a uh, <laughs> did, 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 Oh, go ahead. Go ahead, Kellogg. No, go, no, go. Oh, well, uh, I, I just want to say uh, thank you, Mexican Iron Man. Um, I love you, man. You're you're uh, you're one of the few that that really touched me and, and kept me pushing forward. So uh, you know that's why I wanted to get you on the show and let you know that you know you're a permanent part of the Cotton Connection. And uh, same with you, Tara. You know um, we we kind of found you and found each <laughs> other, I guess. And and uh, you needed a home and. And well, you know, the cotton's always got a hole, right? <laughs> right, Kellogg? <laughs> Obviously. Absolutely. I won't be too inappropriate. <laughs> oh, I don't want to let you down. Drink. Have another drink. Drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, another it shot. might get too wild. I don't Maybe too. <laughs> is there such thing as too wild? That's think, okay. This is yeah, already the second. So, you know. A double negative is a positive. <laughs> I put we two Johnny Walker Blacks nudes. on the rocks in one. Breaking nudes. No ah. rocks in mine. I've got to have it straight and neat. Oh. I can, if I'm going to drink booze, oh. it has to be two Casadorius tequila, and I need pineapple chaser and some Sprite, and I need to have my pink panties on. If I drink tequila, my clothes fall off, so I can't do that. Garcon! Uh, going on to Amazon.com, one case of tequila, 4184, <laughs> Amazon Prime, arrives Tuesday. I've got some Haradura right here, but I can't do that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh-oh, Second Street Marvel's getting jealous. Okay. I've, I've got yeah, to I've gotta go on Trinity's channel. I've, I've promised, so I have to go. Uh, yeah, I hope you go on there oh, with Merle. Uh, I like that guy. <laughs> I, th I think my southern accent's a little bit better, but sorry, Trinity. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Myrtle fucks for sure. Definitely. Definitely. I I, right lots of, lots right of leg wild. in the last video. Oh, yeah. yeah. He gets wild at the trailer park. <laughs> yeah. Every Friday night. <laughs> well, thanks for tuning in. Um, okay, so Empire Strikes Back is 40 years old. 
which means uh, we're old as fuck. If uh, if you remember it from back in the day when it first came out, um, I don't remember the movie, but I do remember Return of the Jedi. Uh, but I do remember getting all the toys, of course, on Christmas. And um, yeah, I mean, do you guys have any special memories that you think of? Uh, yeah. You know, with Empire Strikes Back, maybe a a Christmas or a birthday I definitely, I, or movie experience. I got the, uh, Go for it, Kayla. I got the like bed that Jabba the Hutt laid on, and I got Jabba. The only figure that I couldn't get from that was Slave Leia. Wow. So all the pervy guys bought the Slave Leias, and I never got one. Bastards. I know it's terrible. <laughs> I oh, remember. I want a Slave Leia too. My. My dad walked in on me, and I was performing a sex scene between Lando and Leia, and it wasn't a good day. It wasn't a good day. You started early, bro. Were you Lando, K Log? What? No, it was a. I had a little hard on. Wait, 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 wait what? Were you, were you? Where were you, Lando? Well, in the, you know, I don't know, actually. I could have been already projecting, because that would have been another three-way menage a frog opportunity. But you would have been, like, two years old at the time. Well, I bought the toys, you know, later on when I was, like, seven. But, you know, oh. I think... You could, oh, okay, menage, you were seven. No problem. Okay, yeah, cool. Sweet. In the menage a frog scenario, you could swap out Harrison Ford for Billy D. Williams, obviously. <laughs> Or am I just? <laughs> I remember getting my well, Millennium Falcon uh, toy and then smashing it in a space battle, and then realizing that I couldn't put it back together completely. Oh, it was awful. Yeah, that sucks. You needed yeah, to totally see somebody's got a little too excited. <laughs> see, I was gonna wear my Star Wars shirt. I was gonna wear Star Wars shirts, but then y'all couldn't see my tattoos and. That's like the most fun thing about me. So, you made a business decision. Yes, I did. <laughs> well, it's only your first wow. video, and you already have better lighting than all of us. <laughs> <laughs> I worked on it for a. I worked on it for a long time. <laughs> hmm. I work hmm. on this about the amount of time it takes old bird here to put his hand up my ass. <laughs> I wanted a puppet, but I figured red lighting would work for right now. Speaking of puppet, yeah, where's my favorite? Good. It's working. Where's per where's uh what's up with uh Rovere? Okay. Uh -oh, we gotta say taco or out. something a couple of times. Very nice. Don't say tacos. <laughs> oh no. no. Oh that's right, that's right. Forget it. Change the subject. Back to the back to Empire Strikes back. So what do you think of uh, Return of the Jedi, then? i got to ask you, Snow. You, you, were you one of the ones that liked it, loved it, or mediocre after Re Empire Strikes Back? Hang on there. What did what, you say? I, after I Empire Strikes part. Back, um, when Return of the Jedi came out, were you the one of the ones that liked it, loved it, or were kind of, you know, neutral? Uh, Empire Strikes Back was amazing. Uh, I think Empire Strikes Back was even my favorite as a kid, even though uh, Return of the Jedi was relevant because I can remember it in the movies. I can remember the toy line. I can remember playing with the new toys as they came out. Yeah, but you don't remember the story, uh, huh? But I do remember one of my best Christmas movies. Huh? I said, but, but, you, but, but it, doesn't, it doesn't hit you as hard as Empire Strikes Back, huh? The story, no. no empires, you know. Well, no, because it's all back to my childhood, and of course the the turn of events when you find out Darth Vader's Luke's Luke's father. You know, it's cinematic history. I don't know if we'll get a greater uh, reveal than that. Um, I still don't think it's been outdone. What do you guys think? Agreed. I, Return of the Jedi was the only one that happened while I was born. Like, so I remember seeing that one at the theater. Everything else was mm. pre Terra. So but I did memorize all the words to all the first trilogy. Wow. Whoa. So, yeah. Hey, okay. Go. Go. I I annoyed no, I, I don't remember. I'm old now, so I don't remember, but <laughs> Wow. Oh. 
put her on the spot. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Plus, we all smoked and drank a lot. We drank, we drank a lot tonight, Kaylock. Come on now. Not a, not a lot yet. I'm trying to behave. I've I've gotten a little rowdy before, so I'm trying to behave. Well, you came in the right place. I feel like I feel like this right is place. peer pressure, though, so I may have to. This is Why peer not? pressure. Of course, always. That's what we do here. I know. That's why I'm here. I just got the Speaking weirdest of peer pressure. I just got a, a text message, and it says, "Produce estrogen naturally." I don't know. The government thinks I have a vagina. <laughs> <laughs> That's awful. I think yeah. estrogen Wait, makes me homicidal, so it's not uh, a good thing. Yeah, I, that's like I, it's been a year since I said the word estrogen. <laughs> oh no! Yeah, that's not good. Yeah. Did you guys? Like, the government knows what I'm doing. The that. PMS show. <laughs> or it's not the PMS show. I think we can do anything we want because the government's too busy with aliens now. As a distraction, yeah. Yeah, as a distraction. So we can do anything we want. I think we're in the. I think we got green light to hell. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I think opportunity. There's no ceiling on the opportunity of, of this show and of the cotton connection. We can go anywhere we want. Complete depravity. I like it. Then I want to murder my fucking neighbor Bob because he's been pissing me off lately. Hey, I have the same kind of neighbors, oh, so I can relate. Hell. That's a 10. It's a 10? Don't do it. Don't do it, K-Log. 10? You said a 10? No, a 10. Oh, I think you said a 10. Like Wait. <laughs> that too. My lights keep flickering. What the hell is that all about? You got spirits? Yeah, it's Poltergeist. Yep. It's all right, before. Right. Yeah, yeah, I love Poltergeist the movie. I just watched it again last night. Are you eating tacos, Mexican Iron Man? Not right now. Is that a racist kind of question, sir? Do you look? <laughs> How is that well, a racist kind tacos? of question? Well, your name is Mexican Iron Man. Well, then I would eat tacos. Wow. I'm in Texas. We eat tacos all the time, so not racist. See? Okay, so it's the three of you against me. I see how it is. <laughs> <laughs> how about it's the two of us with you? I hate to break it to you guys, but you know... Leo, oh, no. you're on solo. <laughs> <laughs> but I could be though. Yes, you could. <laughs> oh no! Okay, sorry. well then I'll scrap my slave layout outfit for Halloween. Oh wait, wait! You missed, you missed what you said, Kay. Kay. Say no, it again, Tara. You missed it. I can't remember. You, you want me to skip my slave Leia ha no. Halloween costume? That's a hard no. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Uh oh! Uh oh! Look what we did. We, we meet at the last Mexican Iron Man face to Damn face. You, de I finally found you. <laughs> Damn you, Perro de Robert. Where are you? You're in Arizona? Where's my boy? Jolly. What have you done with him? Don't worry about it. What have you done with him? No say. No. Oh. That doesn't matter. Don't bring your Rosetta Stone shit to this party, buddy. <laughs> I you don't go to the wall. Here. You quit supporting the funds. You quit supporting the channel. What fans? We end you, you traitor. You're a traitor to your own your own kind. How am I a traitor to my own kind? You're not Mexican. Well, you all don't right, want to build the here, wall. But I'm Mexican. But we don't we don't need your kind of Mexican here, oh. buddy. <laughs> yeah. No bueno. <laughs> <laughs> Mexican Iron Man. See, that's what happens when you said taco three times. Look, you don't never, you never support this channel. Perro de Robert, hold on, I'm going to summon. I'm afraid of the hold green on, I'm, I'm going to summon. I'm going to summon all the energies, and I besiege you to leave. There you go. Was that some voodoo shit? I don't no. know what's going on here. <laughs> it's, okay, a you know, it's, that, it's the uh, arc reactor shit. See, it's, I'm oh. summoning the energy from the arc oh. reactor. Yeah, yeah. You're a bad boy. <laughs> Bad boy, go home. Oh no, okay, boy. Boy. It's a great people. It's a people verde. No, no, say the people verde. It's a people verde. Ah! <laughs> that was a big dick energy blast right to the face. <laughs> Good job. That's 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 a that's a kind of uh, 
The guy who we say at the um, the girth. The, no, it's the NC seventeen Avengers strike again. For sure, this girth is from Birth Power. <laughs> Super Kermit, Terra, <laughs> and Mexican Iron Man. <laughs> NC seventeen Avengers unite. Yeah, this is like a trauma film. Yeah. <laughs> We should do it. That sounds good. We should do that. Yeah. Oh, he used the lightsaber on the 40th anniversary. Oh, cut him in two. Nice. Cut him in two, you stupid dog. Nice. Bad Peril dog. Rovo, no. Pero de Rover Tacos, aisle get three. Up. Carve some dog tacos. Buy two Pero de Rover Tacos. Get oh, one stick. free tonight only. Wow. Cash only. Cash only. <sighs> We're Mexican. Cash only. I was going to make Rainier. a Filipino joke, but Rainier, cool. oh, they're Polynesian. No tenemos máquina de credit card uh, que, um, and stop working right now. He is Mexican. <laughs> son of a bitch. <laughs> nice work, buddy. I, I knew he'd show up. Nice. Ah. Sorry. Sorry. Nice. Sorry about that Mexican Iron Man. No, there's He's nothing to be sorry. He's got a real bad you. taste in his mouth for you, you know? Yeah. Now, I'm not going to eat these tacos, but we'll sell them to, you know, the ones, the you know, folks that go, some, down by the river, you know? I, that sounds right. like a great party. Could be. I really want some tacos, by the way. I'm fucking hungry. <laughs> tacos would be good. Well, yeah. It's no it's time. It's getting late. Wiser. So what? It's 11 o'clock in uh, Texas. Well, yep. I wouldn't eat Taco Bell because I don't trust the people that work there to not you know, rub their dick on the tacos for the t- m- amount of money they're making. I don't Enjoy. trust Taco Bell for anything. Yeah, shit the beans. Taco Bell is not real food. Beans. That's not Mexican food. Taco Bell is not Taco Bell is not it's real, real anything. <laughs> I believe it's soybean oh. product. It only tastes good if you're completely shit faced. Yeah, and even <laughs> then, I heard it was. But even that, oh. yeah, like Waffle House, there was like worms. <laughs> yeah, I don't oh. eat my. I eat here yeah. at like 11 p.m. every day when I'm shit faced. <laughs> Waffle House. Okay. No, Somebody my mom says that I look like stuff. I look like Elizabeth Olsen's uh, Wanda Maximoff, Scarlet Witch. Oh, I love that character. I think it's the it's the red lighting, but I I do have that uh, Halloween costume. Nice. Next but show. I, I was thinking Hella. Hey, I was thinking Hella for this one. Yeah, well, check. Um, the next, you know, next time you come on, you, you're more than welcome to wear that outfit, Tara. Cosplay oh, yeah. next time. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I, that I, that I sounds that sounds like an only that sounds like an OnlyFans thing. Oh, uh, where my own oh. cosplay? <laughs> <laughs> I got maybe we should end this stream a little early. <laughs> maybe we should leave, maybe we should end the stream a little early, K log. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I already. I you know I finished. Her. I'm quick. Oh, well. You guys I've, know though. I finished. Like, fast. I'll set, I'll set up my uh, house DJ turntables and we'll get this party started. Get this porno started. This par- <laughs> <laughs> party, party. Either one, is, I think it works here. A porno is a party. A porno is a party. <laughs> like that scene in uh, Iron Man where he's DJing his own party. I got that whole get up, you know. Wicka, 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 wicka. I'd rather have a party like on Boogie Nights where the guy finds his wife having sex on the on the front well, front porch, you know, in the driveway. Yeah, I don't know if I want to fight. That's not how I want my party to end. Snow. Jolly. American Airlines paging. It's okay. I don't mind talking more. All right. <laughs> Wardrobe change, wardrobe change. So uh I watched I've been working on a on a nightmare and Elm Street project. Okay. And uh I've been, you know, editing and editing and editing, and in the background today I watched John Wick one, two, and three. It nice. was quite the Nice. First yeah. time? No. Come on now. What kind of shit? Come on, Tara. Uh, Come just, on, I, Tara. I, I was just asking. This is I the show where the real men show up. Come on. Yeah, I've seen that movie like fifteen hundred times. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Which okay, so which one's your favorite John Wick film? 
Who are you asking? I, the, it doesn't matter. As long as the car is in it, I'm good. Oh. The car, the car, the car, the violence, and the dogs. Well, I don't know if there's a yeah. He does have a car in the third one, but in this, in the third one, I really like Halle Berry and her dogs. They're so cool. Oh yeah. And the other thing I really love about this uh, trilogy, I, I got my homeboy to watch it today for the first time, and uh, I just love like they have sick ass women in it. You know, they're all believable. Like Halle Berry's out there shooting motherfuckers in the head, and I'm like, I can buy it, even though she's pretty as fuck. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, it's a good storyline. I just don't like the horse scene, you know, where they're running with the horses. And I mean, oh, I, I love that shit. You know you what like I love? Too? I loved in 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 John Wick too when he fights a uh, Bat Girl and she's a deaf person, but she's you know she's pretty feisty and it's oh, like yeah, 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 yeah. no, that's awesome. Like, but, yeah, he tries to fight him and he beats the fuck out of her how he yeah. should, but yeah. she was still badass. You know, I loved it. So good. Yeah, they're my they're my guilty pleasure movies. Right. I know. It's like they they you could do be doing their lighting for the films too. I love yeah. lighting in that film in that whole franchise. Yeah, she went on she went on a co star and what the hell was that other movie where she was a badass? Can't remember. Oh, I don't watch I don't watch films where women are the lead badass. No, she wasn't the lead badass. She was, a, she was like a Oh, okay. I might watch it then. I'm just... joking. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm, I'm, I forgot I'm, it's a ribbit bigot and sexist show. I forgot. <laughs> Of course. No, I like, see, I want to prove I'm not a sexist because I love Kill Bill. Oh, I love Kill Bill. Oh. I, I just like to rip strong female characters, guys. Yeah. I'm actually a feminist. Tarantino's thing with feet, though, is a little weird. It's a okay, lot of so weird. I'm weird too, because lately I've just been fetishizing about people's feet. What? Mine what? has scars and tattoos, so maybe I'll make a post about that, too. Yeah, Kermit will be a good Kermit. Are you serious? <laughs> Haven't you seen like uh, the missing person four one one and like people will go missing the body show up without the feet because that's where all the bacteria is. I'm, I'm always serious when I'm always serious when it comes to boners, pal. <laughs> <laughs> and this has been the stud up show, guys. Where the fuck did I go? <laughs> no, he'll be back. He'll be back. Hey, Kermit, can I make that? Can, can oh, there he is? Where is he? Loading. Oh, where'd you go? Damn dogs! Damn pills! Chewing on the wires! Son <laughs> of a bitch! My cat does that. <laughs> Did he come back from the dead? Oh, the Dobermans came. That's the Dobermans case, came no. through and unplugged everything. No Fuckers. way! Yeah, it was like a stampede. I was freaking out. <laughs> It's all fucked up. El, El Perro released the hounds. <laughs> Is El Perro's body part still there? Did you guys he okay? Go pet cemetery yeah. Style? <laughs> El Perro had his homies at Comcast give it to you, Snow. Yeah. Well, they're about to get get a phone call or a real nasty one. Fuckers. Yeah. I'm going to go all Karen on their ass. Uh oh. Well, your internet's smooth now, man. Right? Your internet's good now. Yeah. Comes and goes. Kind of like me. <laughs> <laughs> There's been a lot of good sex jokes today. I'm really, I'm really <laughs> Comes and goes. <laughs> yeah, my son told me today uh. that he. For his uh, computer, he needed one male and two fema females, and I said, uh, "Hell yeah, we do." Yeah, and, yeah. He hit me. So I like the way he thinks. Yeah. <laughs> you, well, yep. That's, way, that's you, my you dirty things. mind. <laughs> yeah, that's the way. That's the way the world is supposed to work, pal. It is. I think. I agree. Well, I'm waiting on another me to show up here. But Amazon's been sucking. Second Is that what? like a, a really tall prostitute at Amazon? Yeah. Right now, I've been so pent up with the COVID, I'd be like, uh, like uh, what's his name? An American Psycho. Christian Bell. Oh. Yeah, Christian Bell. 
See, yeah, but you know what? Good. It's like it's like Kay, Kay and I have the same problem. We're in the Bay Area where it's like literally, literally The Walking Dead. It, I, you know what? I follow an Instagram page and I've seen it. I wanted to take my kids and I will not do it. Hey, but it's not like it's not as bad as you think. I mean, I'm in a pretty deep San Francisco and there's bad places, but there's nice places too, you know? Yeah. Well, yeah, but I'm just saying, like, in terms of being locked down and shit, dude, I mean, come oh, on. Yeah. We're we're like super locked down for sure. Hey, they put all the crackheads in the nice hotels, and they're giving them. <laughs> I'm not joking. No, this is not a joke. Yeah, yeah I staying, know. They're staying at the fucking Hilton, and they're getting <laughs> free cocaine. That's bullshit. When I, have, when I have to pay for my cocaine like a normal drug addict, they're getting <laughs> they're getting free methadone, free cocaine, free marijuana, and free booze and food. Literally, yeah. We, we need like a change.org petition. Right. I'm okay. I'm fucking moving there if they start providing prostitutes. <laughs> yeah, they're already they're there. Homeless in San Francisco. <laughs> no, but yeah. seriously, they are. They they seriously are. They made a deal with what was it, six or seven of the largest hotels, right? Yeah. Okay. And, and they're covering the cost because they just figured it's cheaper to put one each, each put each one there there. For sure, and it doesn't matter if it's a you know a transgender or male you know prostitute if you got your eyes closed now. No. <laughs> I mean, I can't. Oh, I mean, bullshit. Just, that's it. Yeah, no, that's what happened. I'm moving to San Fran. I'm going to be homeless. Yeah, I'm going to be homeless. Get, now. Get, Here I come, Gary Log. Can you get COVID from getting a blow jay from a hooker? Oh, after the show. Um, ah! <laughs> what? Not if you wash it right after. Yeah, I don't think so. I think you're good. Oh, yeah. Yeah. This is good <laughs> advice, guys. This is good. I appreciate it. Show me how to There's free Coke. <laughs> I think maybe it's really uh, lost her, her touch on this. On the group of work, no? We're running a little wild, my friend. Yeah, the, the medical advice you get on this channel That's is okay. probably not good advice. It's not going to happen eventually. <laughs> yeah, was that yeah. burning there before? Oh, Second Marvel was a free boob job. Oh, what? you could get that here in San Francisco. Who? You just can't no. get bread. <laughs> 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 or toilet paper right here. <laughs> yeah. Luckily, we have toilet paper. Finally, within the last week, it's come back. So it has. It ha it has. We're good. Oh, thank God. Yeah, we, we I haven't ever at, anything in San Jose. Nothing. We, I've been nothing. looking at my, my 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 toilet paper dwindling, and then looking at my right my right hand. <laughs> <laughs> we finally have Cottonelle back wow. in the store, so like the good you stuff. Cotton? There. Cotton? Cottonelle. <laughs> I like it. Is it is the connection? Connection? Of course. Of, and of course, that's why I support it. It's got the name. For sure. Cotton goes right for the ass, guys. <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> Every time. Every time. Straight to it. Straight to it. It's no. Well, thanks for talking about thanks for talking about Star Wars with us. <laughs> Jeez. Wait, we got off topic? Of course we didn't. Not this show. That would never happen. Not no. here. Uh, it's a hard no. <laughs> not this show. Every time. Every time. Look, the whole chat keeps talking about boobs. <laughs> I Showbacks talking about boobs. What did they say? I don't have my glasses Big on. Will's Big way I talking about titties. That's what he said. I can't read anything in the chat when I have the helmet on. Yeah. Here. It should show up in your mouth. Let's see. Uh, free cocaine and hooked. Looks like I'm booking a holiday to San Fran. Hey, Green pain and quarantine. You're not old enough, Big Will. You're not old enough. Oh no. El Perro did something to Tara. Tara, Tara, where'd you go? Oh, that son of a bitch. <laughs> now he's fucking with her channel, k -Log. Well. Hey, Mexican Iron Man. I didn't cut the beam. this what, damn dog. Wasn't me. Wasn't me. You still no, it was, it was I'm about to finish off. I'm about to finish off my third Johnny Walker Black on the Rocks. I think you should go for number four. Right? Yeah, no, El Perro did something to Terra, and now everybody's leaving. Yeah, nobody. The, the whole chat's leaving now. What? The hot one's gone. You know what I've been doing a lot lately? Fuck, I've been I've been drinking a lot and driving a lot lately. <laughs> you can't drive. They'll let the cars out on the streets. Where are you driving? 
You just drive around. There's nobody there. It's like, woo. <laughs> That's not okay. Yeah. <laughs> Slow motion. Wow. They make cars that small? They do. Is it like a Prius? Well, it's San Francisco, Snow. Yes, it's a green oh. Prius. The green penis. Prius. Of course it is. Yeah. All right. I think I'm all one of those I'm all MG out for tonight, no? We've had a lot of cock jokes. Yeah. I'm pretty exhausted myself. Uh, I do kind of miss Miss Tara though, and I hope she's okay. I don't, I don't want El Perro to have his way with her. Wait. Okay. She's uh, coming Vera? back. Yeah, my camera. Are you there? It, it keeps cutting me off. I don't know what the problem is. That's because no. you, you need more freedom, but it's all pearl. <laughs> I do. I've got my kids are on so mm. much more stuff. Right. More Trump change. We need more Trump change. Yeah. Right. I, I called Best Buy today and they said, uh, I think I have been watching too much porn on here. <laughs> Having some oh. technical difficulties. You call Best well, I guess Buy? on that note. Hey, before we sign off, I got a quick well, announcement. I'll try to get her in there one more time. Tara, are you okay? I'm trying to stay on. Speak I don't know me, what's Tara. happening. Speak to me. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. <laughs> All right, well, plug your channel real quick before you go or your Twitter or something. Uh, my Twitter is que at Queen Cassiopeia. Queen Cassiopeia. When are you starting a YouTube yeah. channel, Tara? Oh, I'm not. I'm too controversial. Right now. No. <laughs> Controversial. Uh, too controversial. Maybe I'll think about it. Yeah, you should. You were well, you're always you're always welcome back. I'll Please. be you're always welcome back with the puppets and the cotton connection when you get a connection. Yes. <laughs> right. Mexican what Iron Man. Where can they find you? All right, Mexican Iron Man is on Twitter. Just search for Mexican Iron Man. You'll find me, and same thing on YouTube. I want to announce that. I'm hosting a uh, writing contest that has up to 2,000 in cash prizes, short stories, and the idea is that you pick either Star Trek or Star Wars and you pick up the storyline uh, before the idiots got a hold of it, before Kurtzman and before JJ. So you, you basically start over at movie number seven and you start over in 2009 for Star Trek. So um, I'll wait. post it on my wall where what the rules are, but there's up to 2,000 in prizes for first, second, and third place. Rookies only. If you've already been published, wow. you can't participate. Okay. Can I make a, base network is a, sponsor. a fan fiction where I send Rose Kiko to Whore Island? Yes. That would, uh, yeah. wait, no. Well, you would have to introduce the character Rose Tico in your mythology because. In my mythology, she is skinnier and has a better haircut. Then she probably would not be called Rose Tico. Okay. We're going to call a character Rose Taco. Sure. Okay. Like Thank you, sir. Just gonna say it one more time. Awesome, That's awesome, Mexican Iron. Yeah, Man. we're doing. Yeah, I'm doing the. I'm, I'm, me and Echo Base Network are doing this because here's our our, our philosophy, and, and I tell you, you know, you guys inspire this in me. In a time when everybody is taking our stories and stomping on them, in a time when people are taking the things that mattered most to us when we were kids or young people or whatever age we were at, in a time when the things that we look back on that you know make us feel good about ourselves and these monsters in LA are just stepping on it like fucking Godzilla, you know, on Japan. Let's create, come up with some more creativity. Let's come up with our own stories. And you know what? Let's pay each other for our own stories. And let's show these motherfucking idiots that get these big salaries and these retreats they go to what good storytelling is about. And that's what we're going to do. First, second, and third prizes. God damn Star right. Trek, Star Wars. It's over 2,000 grand, two thousand two grand in prizes. And, um, um, you know, I'll post it up on my wall and just look for Mexican Iron Man, Echo Base Network website. Also has it, and, and we're sponsoring this to get, you know, basically, you know, to show that we as fans can come up with better stuff than these morons have not been able to come up with. Hail! Hail! All right. Love you, Iron Man. Next Love you, guys. Morning, the men. Te amo mucho. And, uh, K-Log, uh, before we end the stream and you're plugging yourself, let's just, uh, let's just gander at the, uh, the amazement as in one of the most hottest ribbon and bigot shows we've ever had. Wow. Thanks for coming out with us, Tara. Woo. 
I think I gained five subs just to have a tear on. Tonight. <laughs> Much love, you guys. Kaylog, you want to plug yourself? Of course, or I want to plug myself. Plug me or plug uh, something? You know, I oh. you just Google Kaylog and I have all types of ill shit. I mean, you know, I'm amazing. So, hey. Hit the like button. Subscribe yeah. to this channel. Yeah. And none of you sons of bitches think about lip shaming me. <laughs> goddamn right. It's a, a deviated septum, goddamn it. Goddamn right. Okay. All right. And, and uh as so I did a little uh did a little tour through Target, checked out some Star Wars toys. They were terrible, but it was funny. So watch it and share. Hey, and tweet and subscribe. I need a thousand subs, damn it. All right. He only needs a thousand. Smash Thanks the like button. In. Hit Much subscribe. Slap that like button. Do it now. Do it now. All right, let's let's we gotta end it off with some hails. Hail Tommy. Thanks for dropping all of them those awesome links. Hail Tommy. Hail Fenner Fire. Hail Fenner Fire. Hail, hail Second Street Marvel. Hail, hail, hail. Hail Lori Bar Roberts. Hail Wookie. Hail Sentinel. Hail everybody. Love ya. Smash the like button. Reach around. Back kisses. What's up, Lonely Panther? <laughs> oh, I'll be here. Hail, LB. Hasta luego. Was he was he just getting there at the end? Was he late? No, nah, he's in the middle there.